Hi guys, it's Trish back with another historical fiction book talk. This time it's Lauren Wolk's new book, Echo Mountain. I had work to do, a hag to save, honey to harvest, a father to save, and more besides. This is where we meet 12 year old Ellie. It's Maine, 1934. The stock market has just crashed. And though Ellie doesn't remember much of that, she knows that she and her family of five, with little more than the clothes on their backs, have been forced to uproot from the only home they've ever known and move to the wilderness of Echo Mountain. Never threatened by the wilderness the way her mother and sister Esther are, Ellie has found comfort and confidence in her new life. Of course, that was before the accident that has left her father in a coma, unable to provide for the family, unlikely to recover, and the blame for the accident squarely placed at Ellie's feet. Ellie takes over many of the chores of her beloved father, confident and comfortable to let her sister and her mother take care of her father. That was until Ellie gets it into her head that enough is enough. Her motto becomes no more lullabies. She's not going to accept this soft approach to helping her father get better. She means business. And she's determined to use the unproven resources of her natural world to help her father recover. This causes great conflict between Ellie, her mother, and her sister. But there's a father to wake. There are these mysterious wood carvings popping up all around Ellie. And there's this old mysterious woman on the mountain known as the hag who desperately needs her help. And perhaps the hag can provide help in return. So much for one young girl to handle. But handle it she will because nobody knows the mountain's secrets and its cures better than Ellie. Ultimately, Ellie's story is one of responsibility and acceptance, connectedness, and realizing that people can change and who we are one day and at one time is not a determination of who we will be forever. So if you're looking for strong girl characters, love of family, or just a great historical fiction read, check out Lauren Wolk's new book, Echo Mountain. It's a long read, but you will not want it to end. Take care, guys.